Well, the weather changed on us. It went from being relatively mild to being kind of messy, and now we're ready for colder temperatures, maybe some snow too. Here's Ray to fill us in. Yeah, we bring the chill uh, when we get to the weekends. Tomorrow's going to be the warmest of the entire forecast, likely the warmest between now and, and after Christmas. So it is going to be a colder stretch. The colder air is already brewing back to the west where you see those snow showers twirling here in Minneapolis to Bismarck back into Chicago, and that's eventually going to cycle its way into western Pennsylvania. So Pittsburgh is going to be looking at some snow showers. Now we're still just a little too warm for that. Rain is uh, crossing over the state line right now. Some scattered light showers and because of that, any of this moisture lifting up into the ridges still runs the risk of freezing. So we still have our winter weather advisory until midnight. A little leftover time on that as those showers go up the ridges. You could have a little additional ice, but once that uh, last line comes through, the winds are going to change up and the atmosphere is going to change up uh, as you go higher up into the sky and that's going to give us a better shot for just uh, scattered snow showers. So we're going to turn off the, the rain potential, but still temperatures below freezing in the ridges near 40 degrees around Pittsburgh and you can see going back into Akron and Cleveland. It's the mid 30s. We have those mid 30s here in town as well, so we're going to lose uh, uh, a couple more degrees between now and tomorrow morning and then highs tomorrow are going to be found generally near 40 degrees. So uh, a mild day, pretty typical day temperature wise tomorrow, but that's about it. Temperatures from there are going to drop. So let's talk precipitation. You get uh, the last little batch of rain moving through and then some snow showers. Those are going to be hanging around uh, through the day tomorrow, just kind of on and off hit or miss snow showers. Once we get into Saturday, another batch swings through and then another one on Sunday. So it's just going to be these little waves of snow cutting through the area. But the deal is they're not going to really amount to too much for most of us. We're going to get generally a situation where most of us see a dusting if that so a dusting or less in most locations you can see here even the models aren't pumping out big numbers uh, inch or two up into the ridges. But generally this is going to be low impact snow but it's a sign that it's going to be colder and it's setting the precipitation up to be what a lot of people want it to be this time of year. The white stuff tonight, though, we're going to be drying out. We're going to finish the last of that rain up 34 degrees for our low. Tomorrow's temperatures will be found about 40 degrees. And again, that's the warmest of the whole bunch. So if you like the warmer temperatures, enjoy it. But you can see here it comes with some hit or miss snow around. Uh, cold front comes through and then our temperatures drop from there. So getting into your Saturday 35 32. That's it for Sunday. We start off Hanukkah in the evening. Uh, it will be colder and then temperatures stay on the colder side all the way through the forecast. But you'll notice between Tuesday and Wednesday and Thursday, those temperatures are going to be sliding down and they're going to continue to slide the way things are looking right on through Christmas.